evening, everybody. Hello, gamers. <laughs> Hello, Koji. Hey, Azer. Uh, not that you two are gamers. Uh, it was gamers, comma, Koji, Azer, etc. Yeah, but good evening, everybody. Uh, why is why is my chat box still going over the Winamp source every time? Anyway, uh, let me switch over to the just chatting. You're gamers, yeah. Word number is actually gamers. Um, hello. Uh, so I got out of work early today. I was planning on streaming tonight anyway, but I, I wasn't planning on streaming something new. Uh, so that's kind of where I ended up on with uh, Planet Laika. I was like, oh, I've been this has been on my list forever. I, I don't think I mentioned it before, but yeah, it's definitely been on my list to play since I saw the fan translation come out. But um, we can talk about that later. Uh, yeah. So I decided to stream early, uh, start something complicated, stream for longer, better at, you know. I have to work early again tomorrow, but that's okay. We're still here. Uh, Planet Laika is about dog people uh, on a journey to Mars. Uh, it's going to be interesting. I, I don't know too much about it. I've kind of uh, not read anything about it. We're still here, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's the portal song, right, Koji? Uh, we're still we're still here in gaming. We're still gaming, alive. No, that sucks. That sucks. Uh, yeah. G good seeing you all. Um, on this this fine Thursday night. Uh, I'm trying to get back into a regular streaming schedule, so I think I'm gonna stream um, this weekend again as well. Like, probably probably Sunday. Now listen, I didn't I didn't pick this this Winamp skin, all right. I mean, I did, but it's it's fine. <laughs> was it? It was slid off the screen for some reason. That's strange. I I didn't. You know, people made some interesting Winamp skins back in the day. I don't I don't really get the connection there either, but it's there. It exists. You have to acknowledge that there's a Winamp skin that looks like this. But um, no. So I think I, I wanna I wanna hop in. Up into the Dog Planet game, but uh, it's my week hasn't been that busy, you know. Played more. I played a bunch of Dark and Darker this last weekend, like way too much of it that I uh, had to stop because I, I realized that it was just an alpha and there were going to be resets, and I can't just dedicate this much time to this game. That's like just a nothing, right? Uh, what else we got? Uh, it was I, Wario Land 2 went great. Gonna resume that. I'm thinking of starting a, a big long RPG this weekend, or maybe possibly continuing playing it like because it's about 12 to 20 hours long. So I guess we can we can jump into it. Oh, it didn't change me there. Change me back. I gotta fix that. That's on me. Yeah, nice weekend game. That's the thing is the the weekend streams like. Hey, Codward. The, the weekend streams are always uh, the best ones because they uh, they use. I, I have more time to like dedicate to uh, stuff. I have more time. I have more attention to dedicate to it. I'm not as sleepy from work. Um. Oh, I guess uh, a couple things first. Wait, let's get to let's get to the title screen. No reason not to load this in, right? Uh, but so a couple of things. I come to the territory of a uh, streaming early in the evening, thankfully. Um, it's actually just one thing. Well, okay, it is. It is. It is slightly two things. Uh, up here. So I did finally. Um, Robin is finally sleeping on my bed. Uh, which means Robin returns in in, uh, in cam form. <laughs> I can finally show off my sliding in Robin cam uh, TV. That is uh much more convenient. Let me I, I let me center it though real quick. I gotta adjust that myself. He he just moves, you know. He just moves. Pizza Tower emotes. There 
is he's blending into his the natural scenery now. He's, it's kind of tough to see. So this is Planet Laika. This is recently fan translated in I think like uh, 2021. Uh, it's like a, it's more like a, it's like a visual novel horror thriller game kind of thing. I, I don't know too much. What did you do if you found out? That's... Yeah, that's what いったい何をしでかすやら。そんなことが本当にあなたの身の上に起きたらどうしますか。この自分じゃない自分が三人もいて平気なんでしょうか。お話の舞台となる火星には荒ぬ妄想を掻き立てる力が潜んでいるというではありませんか。おお、恐ろしい。厄介なことにならなければいいのですがね。Yeah, I did know about this intro. I love this intro so much. Welcome to Dog Planet Cardboard. Go land the system check. Now approaching perimeter of the face in the Sidonia region. Standing next to the face, a eh? yeah, Martians always trying to taunt us. Yeah, you'll notice there's a big theme in this game of faces. <laughs> That's Pepino on the screen. Hey, QXC, it's good seeing you. You you know full well that the Martians are long extinct. They all died in Moss the moment they put on human faces. Who knew the face pact would lead to such an unhappy end? Robin Spaghetti. Yuri says our faces were what triggered the Martian ex extinction. I Those filthy Martians' bodies didn't deserve our pure human faces. You know, I don't usually talk about uh, other streamers unless I know them personally, but can we just acknowledge that I, I beat... I beat Germa to playing original Xbox by like two years. Human faces. Anyway, back to the game. Yeah, exactly. Never heard of him. I'm just saying. One theory says it was triggered by bacteria. Oh! Brought from Earth. I don't care, Captain. Blame facial bacteria all you want. Next is entering Martian orbit. Not repeating it. Anyway, yeah, so now instead of having the Robin cam offline, or the Robin uplink offline um, screen, I can just put him away when he's gone. Hey, Fungus. That crazy glow, that Mars. That's Mars. See that crazy ass glow? Star of Disaster, Symbol of Conflict, and Planet of Deception. Okay, I'm not putting Pepino in there. If you want to... Yeah, they have tails and weird dog faces. Wait, do you see what they look like? They're... Yeah, it is. Oh, I thought you actually knew about this one, because this is another like recent PS1 game translation. There's nothing redeeming about Mars or anybody living on it. I think it came out a little bit before the Racing Lagoon one did, but I've... 
I gotta say, QXC, I, I've become so much more, uh, I've been so retro-pilled lately, like, just, yeah, why would you want to play new games? There's a billion other games that are out there. Are you there? Like, there's so many games that nobody's played. Like, that you can play right now. Thanks, Stream <laughs> Yeah, Stream Elements, really, really, thanks a lot. There's so many games, like, that's... Did you know I'm live? I gotta, I actually gotta get rid of the stream. I, I gotta depreciate the stream element spot. I don't really use it anymore. I haven't. I'm putting it on my list. I, 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 my goal is to play it at some point this year on stream. I don't know if it's long. If, it might be too long to stream. We gotta stream on the monitor. It's from Earth. But like, I can't believe you're, I can't believe you do this to me. Oh. Hey, cardboard. Have a nice day. I, well, I know you love that game. Is that you? This is October, your mission commander. Personally recommended you for this survey unit. Yeah, I might have to do a weekend stream block for it, or like two weekends in a row. Two weekends in a row where I'm working like Saturday, where I'm going Saturday, Sunday, Saturday, Sunday, streaming it. I bet I can do it. As you know, you're headed to Mars. This will be no ordinary survey. See, a rumor is sprouted that describes malicious monsters having appeared on Mars. This, among other things, has left people fearing that the end times are coming from Mars. I have not seen Wanru. Obviously, this rumor is nothing more than baseless conjecture, but it threatens to halt our terraforming plans the very same. I formally ask that you identify the source of the rumor. Laika, do you recognize this man? Colonel Galil, former leader of the Vanguard unit for Earth's previous mission to Mars. Hey, Farmsteads. Yeah, I've been wanting to play this forever, too, and I was just like, oh, fuck it, I'm starting it, like, tonight. <laughs> I'm just gonna pull the trigger. I still want to play Hypnospace and finish Hypnospace, but I want to play some something a little more, like, brain-intensive. Ten years ago, we sent a Vanguard unit to Mars. They went to survey their air while Earth reattempted colonization. Colonel Galil was the vanguard unit leader at the time, but yeah, no, these are weird dog, like, these are like unsettling dog people, you'll see what I mean, they don't look, uh, oh, that's Robin, He's... I built this, I built this fancy stream thing, um, it took me forever to figure out on my own, but it was very rewarding, where I can do this to him, and I can put him away, uh, I built it all myself, come back, Robin, and then he just like refused he refused to like lay in my room for like the next like five streams. Like he just refused to sit in here. I didn't draw it though. I, I did I did actually take the uh I did take the, the TV frames from Pizza Tower, but you know. Uh, I built the I built the little like slide out and stuff. <laughs> it's true. I thought about doing that, um uh, the criminal wired in a bizarre final message. I, I thought about doing that, um or, like the offline would just be like a slideshow of him but like I was like I could just put it away I want to just put it away like it's, I just don't need to have the TV on it's okay he's not on if he's not on the screen he's the main event like forever God is dead right after that that weird rumor began spreading about Mars our mission now is to find who or what sparked that rumor uh, once we report back we can declare Mars safe to terraform oh I meant to say too I had someone um Ask me why I was playing through, uh, what was it, Xbox, uh, why did I play through Xbox Half-Life 2, and I was like, I thought it was a unique experience, you know, it's definitely not, like, it's not considered, like, the best version of it or anything, but, like, I still think it's, like, a worthwhile experience to play these weird home ports of, like, games that are supposed to be good, or even just, like, weird licensed games, you know, like, Playing through Half-Life 2 on Xbox was that's like that was like a, a way a bunch of people played that game and only the only way they played that game and it's a completely different experience. It's it's great. Yeah. Sometimes you get an awful port, like StarCraft 64. Exactly. I, I was gonna say I do need I do have that copy of a uh, Deus Ex: The Conspiracy for PS2. Playing Half-Life 2 in the arcade. Item bag is empty. Uh, yeah, so I, I do want to play through Deus Ex on PS2 at some point, because I hear it's like a nightmare port. 
Grab the wheel to vanish the way he did. There they are. It's been a decade. The mad dog could be dead for all we know. I've never actually beaten, like, uh... Yeah. They might be a bit pre-rendered. Colonel Galil was possessed by an evil energy hidden on Mars. Said that unless one has a great deal of mental fortitude, they're subject to fall. All sorts of bizarre fantasies. Fantasies, I. What was Galil's fantasy? To play God? Revive the Martians? I need fantasy, too. <laughs> Come to believe this job's not a waste of me damn time. Yeah, they look like they look like the tank girl, uh the the rippers or whatever, the, the kangaroo people that look awful. That just look more terrible, that look the worst, that look uh, the uh, insulting and just disgusting to look at, and they're awful. They look much cooler than their, their cool predator armor, but whatever. <laughs> Sorry, way to spend Christmas so you know it. Oh, it's a Christmas game, too. Wow. According to Commander October, Mars's topsoil is toxic to humans. Surface exposure can have negative effects on the human psyche. That's why I'm here. I'll do extract samples for uh, further research. Solving the big puzzles, are you? Interesting. It's like they... Ex I, I don't actually know yet. Like, so... What it seems to be, they talked about something called, like, a face pact. So I'm assuming that, like, they, like, took on animal DNA, like, just enough to, like, not be affected by this, like, weird mind virus that's on uh, Mars' surface. Like, I'm if I remember right, there's something about how they, 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 like, splice animal DNA in the future to, like, overcome human shortcomings, which is, like, for, like, space travel. But also, I think they just wanted to make a game about dog people. God is dead, I am the light. What does that mean, eh? Yeah, they have no noses and no tails. I mean, he shines here. He's covered in blooming Christmas lights. Speaking of Christmas, we, uh, for Valentine's Day, we watched, um, uh, Tokyo Godfathers, like the Satoshi Kon movie, and that was, uh, that was great. That was so much better than I expected, but it was just funny we watched a Christmas movie for, uh, Valentine's, and then I didn't know this was a Christmas game. Phoenix is now in orbit. We're finally on Mars. Are you greenhorns up to the task? <laughs> they look like furry, like, furry, like, room door, ha like, party door hanger art from, like, the 80s. Yeah. We count on a rookie radio tech and a geology boffin up in space. Easy noon. Everyone is the first time. They, they, <laughs> these fucking cat dancers. For when it's the first time. Leica, you haven't experienced space flight before, have you? Captain, Leica's done one artificial satellite repair prior. I was there. Artificial satellite, got it. And speaking of artificial, Leica's a nickname, right? What's names on your paperwork? Oh, God. Hello? Oh yeah, no, Tokyo Godfathers. Amazing movie. Did not know did not know that like Yakuza is like basically one it's one of the main inspirations for Yakuza is Tokyo Godfathers. Kiranov. Sounds fancy. Oh they made it Russian. Folks had some pedigree. Uh but like just this focus on like the people who live at the margins of Japanese society humanizing them. It was very, very good. Very good movie. Sticking with Leica. And then I watched the I watched the pilot again for Hollywood Dog. <laughs> we just had dog on the brain. It's just like bad bad dogs on the brain. <laughs> bad looking dogs. That's right. See it. That's the face. There it is, everybody. It really does look like a face. He sculpted out a pure supplication before us humans. Maybe the Martians left this so no one would forget what we had. Or we wouldn't forget what they took. Alright, everyone. Get ready to land.
its purple fluff as it smoke. Uh, this like sound is like overbearing. Am I checking the landing point one more time? Noon, what happened? Answer me, Noon. This landing angle is too steep. Crash into the surface at this rate. Switch it off auto. I hate it. Oh no. Me, was I bad again? Wait. Are you alive? Y'all following? Supposed to be gone. Uh. You fooled everyone. These are hallucinations. Merry Christmas, everybody. No, I did. That was my... The grip, Noon. It's fake. This is the planet's sick power at work. I love to be. I love when a planet makes me delusional. Monsters are in the mind. Weapons look. Whoa. Long ago, Earth and Mars made a pact where humans surrendered their faces to the Martians in exchange for peace. Oh, here we go. Here's the backstory. As soon as Martians wore these faces, their kind went extinct and the planet was overtaken by runaways and exiles. Then, as if it's of its own will, Mar began to emit a vile energy that fed malice. The energy was named Evil Mind. Y'all following? yourselves. We all need to work together. No more slip-ups. Am I, am I clear? No, yeah, no more getting delusional off Mars gas, y'all. This is... <laughs> y'all wondering about those balloons and shit that they keep shooting down. Well, it's this, it's this purple Mars gas. They're sending <laughs> balloons full of it. You landed safely and with zero engine abnormalities in your point noon. Anything less than you, you'd have been fired, or worse. And it's only thanks to Noon that we landed without an accident. Who cares about accidents? If we dent anything, we'll fix it later. <laughs> My point is, let's cut the small talk and head out. We're dragging the mad dog Galil back to Earth. Let's be quick. I hate Mars. Anyone stolen away here clearly lost their mind. Some were exiled. They're forced to live out here. If can't get along with the residents, this won't be easy. I'll make them cooperate. Whatever works. Is everyone ready? Hey, look at their little tails. You waiting for Laika, you go first. Turn right after the hatch, that'll take you outside. Do some exploring. Make sure your helmet's on nice and tight before you do. Pleasant shade of green. Run from the rocket, there's no crying to mummy. Yeah, the faces aren't great. They're kinda they get they get more and more terrifying. You know, that's why they swapped them with the Mar for the Martians, right? It all makes sense. I got a shit. It's a fun- yeah, it's definitely a different art style, at least. 
bit unsettling, but I think I do think it's probably like on purpose. Chianum Oblivionis. Here I come. You think the monster rumors were made up? Don't think the residents on Mars are lying to scare us off to you. Oh, good. Their suits leave their tails out. We missed our intended landing site by a hair. Let's make for the colony. Another fruit there to be reaped from today's labor. Rumor says our ex-Vanguard units are living up there in secret. Dude, how far are we from the colony? These helmet designs are awesome. Remember correctly, shouldn't you be up on the Yosemite Plateau? Yeah, where the hell are we? We're in Oceanum Oblivionis. Beyond this is a path that trails up to Yosemite Plateau. From there we pass through the Inductive Hills, named a croc in it. It's from inductive fruit reasoning, that's a philosophical term. The generalizing of conclusions based on overlapping observation. I'll have to save this lesson for later, but once we get through the Inductive Hills, we hit the colony. Can we tell them we're from Earth? Earth to the colonies are check like his equipment and take on the back and an element on the dome heart beating out of the old chest too okay. sandstorms coming we can't dawdle if we want to reach the colony before dark don't stray from the group so watch out for evil mind <laughs> what's evil mind all that purple stuff you go you don't want touch. It's the malice of Mars. Evil Mind stirs up fantasies in the victor victim's brain. Makes them go AWOL. I think a lot of it too, I mean it is like a, it's a fan translation, but also like I'm sure there's just like only so much context the game actually gives. I leave it pretty ambiguous. I can't see a damn thing. Not sure how much farther we can wade through this. Yeah. <laughs> Off that evil mind. The only one who despises sand. Oh boy, we got a sand hater here, everybody. Not the safe house. We found a safe house and went blissfully into sleep. When they woke up, they were already home on Earth. Yeah, everyone, everyone, if you love sand and you love eating sand, please sound off in the chat. Oh. That's something, I, let me, I'm gonna see if I can find this real quick while this, this goes through this stuff. Don't fall behind, you get lost. Oh, am I, am I like, supposed to be moving here? Robin is awake. Oh, I found it. Okay. I found it. I found it. Perfect. Sec. Oh, I'm getting evil minded. Shit. Are you talking to the stars again? A life space brain. I wasn't paying attention. How long do you plan on playing the boring goody two shoes? Don't look at me with those eyes. Gotta fight off these delusions. I think I just died. Did I just game over? That was like really quick. Maybe that was that was supposed to happen. Hear that? Your Vladimir and Sergei's voices. I know. I passed out from the evil mind. That's what you missed so far. Although I did see a glowing treasure on the way. Also, welcome. My brightly glowing treasure. Back at the landing site? I I doubt it was treasure, but I saw it too. Something lodged in the rock. We got Spacer and Yolanda. 
power could come in handy for yanking stuff like that out, Ernie. Where are we anyways? This place is a shithole. Not feeling any Xmas cheer here, not with the things this desolate. I think that was messed up. I think that was supposed to be Ernie talking. I think the planet's surface is affecting Pyrrha. You live in the cloud dimension. That's just, why is it in the cloud dimension? You're so right. We heard voices. These voices come from deep, dark childhood memories. Pyrrhanov still hasn't forgotten all about all that. We're getting a contact high? Aren't we lucky? Whatever it is, the three of us have more shifts soon. None of us will be home for Xmas. Being a radio tech for the ISF sure is a fucky little job. Yeah, let the kid have their fun. I was getting bored, so if this deck if this deck's all our holes, I'm in. I like Ernie. Oh, from inside the rockets, the real deal then? I mean, that face we landed on really exists too. Right, Joe, we're near the face. Major Martian archaeological site. I assume the site is related to the survey unit's mission somehow. I didn't know there was this much writing in this. Not that there's a problem, I really like the writing, but. Oh, that's right. Aren't human faces made here? Can we all get surgery too? We don't let me with you two. I'm earnest, understand? Never down, Ernie. Are you trying to say surface right now? Yeah, who knows what had happened with me on the woods? I'll have to find out later. Someone's coming. A dimension. Made up of three clowns. Spirit man. Go, Pierno. Pierno, you were not alone after all. More complex than you look. What is this thing? Spirit man looks. It looks like a robot from like. Planet's brewing with evil. It looks like a robot from like the black hole or something. A seventies like sci-fi movie. Exposure to it will slightly affect you. When that happens, you'll undergo a personality shift. Make contact with an influence as in another person. A colorful aura will leave said influence to enter you. Although that aura designates what type of evil you'll absorb. Now let's check the condition of your mind via the mind scope. That's what my mind is. <laughs> it's my mind, everybody. The dude in a little hover pot. Yeah, it's like a great gazoo type. Everybody's mind looks like this. Hell yeah. Look at this interface. I'm gonna, um, save state here. Um, because I want to share something with y'all real quick. Uh, that just came to mind. Huh? Um, but it's, it's super important, and you'll see why. When you can just do anything. I think I'm capturing Vivaldi's sound anywhere, am I? I don't think I am. <laughs> Uh, okay, I gotta turn on desktop sounds real quick. Oh, this is... oh no, where'd my Vivaldi source go? Right, we might have to come back to this. I did record this on my TiVo. Someone did. This is not working. I'll have to come back to this. <laughs> it was working earlier. Arrgh. Oh well. We're back. I did not record that. That was That's a video that's been uploaded for like 15 years. However long did it say? 13 years. No, I only- you know I only use Vivaldi for- for, for stream, right? Oh, absorb some green. Yeah, it's startled. Can't say I blame you. Evil aura is a sensation felt by all humans on Mars. When you were touched by evil, it changes you.
Yo, I don't know how to say it. Yo, yo. Oh yeah, I want to try to see if I can pull that treasure out of the rock they were talking about. I don't even know if I can like... <laughs> okay, I can't go back that way. evil I got the poo on me I don't understand planet is horrible in more ways than one and evil in more ways than that do you think you can handle it uh, I took mental damage my, my mental strength went down to three points Am I supposed to, like, avoid those? Bitter memories will resurface. Not only memories, but lies and truths as well. They'll rise up only to confuse you. Yeah, it's like they hurt me. But it's also telling me what the game is what's going on. Can't, can't go that way, I guess. I guess I have to encounter all these. Can't afford to be weak. Uh-oh. Strangely, I can't tell if you're strong enough to last. The guy I saw earlier was so scared. He must be so weak. <laughs> Where do you want me to go? <laughs> Makes me jump. That stalks me at every turn. Oh, okay. You are like a uh, hanging in there. I'll tell you what, the sandstorm is making my head spin. The safe house is this way. Let's not keep the other two waiting. Stinky puddle though. Do I want to absorb this? Not really sure how that works. My my red is filling up though. Yeah, it's a game about collecting farts. Welp, there it is. I see the safe house. This is weird. I, I feel all twisted. Must be the sandstorm's fault. The sand's getting in my head. A purple pea super was getting the better of us earlier. I don't sense any good coming from the mission. You know, I just realized I, I think the screen is squished on my source. Getting a little squished. Let me fix that. I see where it's squished. Okay. I see what I did. There we go. sense any good coming from this mission. I'm hoping the captain doesn't either. <laughs> this keeps happening. 
Mars sucks. Go any closer. Is that you? He sure is having a time. I'm not gonna say all that. Is I bad again? I didn't say yo yo. You're just trying to get more out of me. This is this is big Yidus all over again. I dog. Am. I sure am. I like Robo Dog. I like with the wizard hat. Oh, bloody hell. Sorry, I remembered something heavy. Hey, does this look like a safe house to you? It sure looks like one to me. This guy. Oh, he's the save dog. Yeah, that's the eye dog. Go then. That's worried. Are you okay? Everyone's here. I'd like to say some words. That sandstorm was not the warm welcome I hoped for. <laughs> All the more reason to haul ass and reach the colony before nightfall. How far are we from the colony? Colony? Is someone expecting you? Waiting to tuck you in? Genius, you know we can't camp out in the middle of nowhere. We should give him a break. Got a job to do. How far are we from the colony? <laughs> it's a wee -hee -hee -hee. Colony, take me to the colony. Take me home. Listen to me, dumbass. We don't have time for this. This is a mission here. My mission. You need to safeguard the lives of your crew. Taking a break beats dealing with this oaf on the road. Go and survey the area until noon comes down. At the very least, I want a safe route secured for us before dark. The terrain here gives off oxygen, so we don't need helmets anymore. You're clear of the evil mind stuff. Now go to scouting. Whatever you do, don't get your brain poisoned. Yeah, the, the, the ground gives off oxygen. It's fine. Oh. Bars making your skin crawl? There's nothing to be scared of. This place is just like home. I'm smelling some blue stink, a, bl a blue fart somewhere. Where is it? Huh. Let's planet Leica, everybody. How are you feeling like it's evil mind affecting you no i know evil mind got to the captain he's acting strange too you know the captain and i beat you to the safe house when the captain and i got here he was muttering chloe 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 the name of the girl he knew it was so unsettling you told me once about the captain and his relationship with chloe had to make chloe back when they were in the military academy he loved her like a sister but then she died in an accident noon says the captain still keeps her photo on him Anyways, we have work to do. Let's look around a little and check back. This kind of makes you, like, relive trauma, I guess? Your evil mind is inside us all along. 
Took the shadows. Come on, like this way. I'll show you the room I was born in. What? I see. They brought us here, and everyone just immediately loses their shit. Probably have to go through this door. Or it's gonna kill me. Yeah, this is great. いけないわ。その箱を開けちゃう。中には悪魔が閉じ込められているの。エフ。さ、エフ。クリスマスプレゼントはもうおしまいにして。私のところに来て、エフリル。さ。ありがとう、ボイスアクティング。Mars makes it great, makes you go like, makes you see a door in the desert. I lost you. The colony is straight ahead and I don't see any evil mind. No sign of sandstorms either. Captain has his heart set on reaching the colony today. I'm not keen on that idea, but still we better regroup. that doors wide open I wonder if the captain took new now we would have seen them right I really like the dog robot I guess it was a jump cut like well that was the thing like I, I wasn't pressing like a or anything I, I was holding down forward but that's like what i held down to get into the cutscene. so like i didn't know there was a cutscene coming so i don't i don't know how that would trigger that probably not good Whoa. Yeah, playing with that toy rocket. What? Give it here. You dropped on your fucking head? Why can't you be like Sergey? Jesus. Hey Jordan, guess what? Bacha hates your guts. <laughs> that, oh, it's there's so much swearing. Yeah, this is a fan translation, all right. It's in the mama. Just keep yourself together. Vladimir is your new father. Sergei is your new brother. You say you always wanted a big brother? Try to get along with Sergei, okay? I don't think this was in the closet in the safe room. Yeah, that was actually Robin making those sounds. Baby sounds. He's, he's tucked in right now. Oh, he it was tucked in earlier. In the croissant roll.
face dogs. Let's go. Oh, April's gone too. I don't want to touch that. I actually just want to go to the colony. There, weren't you just here? You think's great. You're an opposite. Fuck. Damien, huh? You're so shifty. I have an extra hard time getting a look at you. I guess this is are these the Martians? Oh yeah, there you can you can see the dog face up close. Oh they are, yeah. Laika, that's your nickname, I see. I'm Damien Hee Hee, Damien the kid who shifts like the sand. So Laika, would you like to know where your two friends went? I tried to lead them, but they wandered off part way. That's a it's a beautiful game, isn't it? There you go. Welcome to the dog planet. Hey Rachel. Planet called out to those two and they answered it over me. Friends sure are weak, huh? At least the girl followed my directions to the inductive hills. Although it's strange, you you alone are above my influence. Why is that? That's the real puzzle. Anyway, the girl seemed a little tired. Be just ahead along the inductive hills. Yeah, it's really all over the place. I love it. Here, you can have this. It's called the sand sym sympathy. If you need me for anything, use this, I will answer. You need to do so out here in the sands, of course. If not, how am I supposed to hear? Yeah, someone said it was an RPG, but I was like, I was pretty sure it was like an adventure game, right? Like, it's, it's an adventure game. It does not seem like an RPG at all. I guess that's true, you're still playing a role in an adventure game, right? You know, there's no there's no stats, which is nice. I could say I found the others, but little boy just now, did he use hypnosis or something? Yeah, like this is just like you have one inventory and you run around. I don't, know, I don't know if there's even combat in this. Yeah, I found it was on the path before I knew it was happening. Be careful. We can't let this planet get inside our heads. You volunteer for this operation, Laika? Yeah. Not too much about the survey unit's missions when I joined. All I had to do was collect samples of Martian topsoil, but now it's hardly important. A new commander October believed Martian topsoil held toxic agents. Even still, my invitation to join the survey unit came out of nowhere. I wasn't truly interested in coming until I heard you'd be here. What? It's on Mars. Today's Christmas, so it's a Christmas on Mars too. Oh, a Christmas sunset on Mars. It'd be more romantic. Wish I was feeling better for this. Do you mind if I rest here for a bit? Step ahead. We're gonna ask for a man named Harad. He runs not only the oxygen dispensary, but the entire colony. You go see him, you might catch Noon and the captain. Yep. As soon as I catch my breath, make for the colony. Okay. Music's really good.
Oh, fuck. Don't want to go back. Good luck getting in yet, a eh? nope. Be simple for a psycho, but I can't see the eyeball. Really, and he's always hiding things from me. Really more like an interactive movie. What's this? You're a new face. What's your type? Are you another psycho, perhaps? Psycho types can see a big eyeball on that far door. Do you see one? I take it you don't. Are you an animal type, then? You look so frail. Don't tell me you're a visual type. I mean, you're a dog face. You must be from Earth. It brings you to this heap. Trash place, trashier people. You don't want to get caught up with anyone's junk. Getting my Nen diagnosed. Yo, yo, that's one visual type who cares too much about appearances. All dwellers of Mars carry a hidden evil. As you speak with them, their evil will accumulate in your mind. That evil will eventually change you. What? I got a, I got a big forehead and I'm red. Here now, I've not touched the mirror. It won't reflect your current self. Rather, it reflects the self of the evil you've harbored. The mirror will draw out the faces shown in the mind scope. Okay. This is like a full heal, basically, in my mind. Maybe not. Maybe this is not good for me. Oh, this is surprising, Kyo Kyo. Seems like it might be good for me. Your heart is even darker than I thought. Everything is frozen in place, the color is all gone. And on Christmas. Yeah, basically this is like a torture simulator of yourself. Bad over and over. Out. Ah, there you are, and who are you, friend of Piranov? I'm Ernest, what do you want? You're an animal type. Either you shut up or I'll you'll answer my question. You see me now, right? Did you see me through Piranov's eyes too? Not clearly, no, it's hazy in there. Are you the one who called us? On the Mars? Answer me. I didn't call you. The wheels of fate turned all on their own. This was like uh, before Majora's Mask. It's similar to it though, definitely. Hey Pazuzu. Yeah, this game's got fucking sick cutscenes. <laughs> Finally ready to find a true sense of self, Ernest. Uh, I'm Ernest. Weird robot arms. I don't know if this is an Event Horizon. I mean, this is PS1, so it's that's definitely why it looks this bad. How oh, gold acquired. Those Ernest, I can punch walls apart. And put, punch treasure out of walls. What's up? Where are you going in such a... There was something up ahead for you. There's still much for you don't know. You're the last person I need telling me about buzzing around. I can't help it, Ernest. Is something going to happen? You must work it out on your own. Take this time to study. I don't think he's going to learn. Bye. That's right, you take it back. But don't you talk about the PS2 that way. I don't know, I bet you could use like old Maya. I bet it's archived up on like, um, I'm sure it's up on archive.org. You just need to set up like a whole, you'd have to get a setup for it. Like I, I know I know a friend who has a couple of silicon graphics computers, like the old 3D rendering computers, which is like wild. 
But I'm sure if you get your hands on like something like that too, you could run it really well. The world can't be overcome by brute force alone. I don't know if they like scale up now, but you can use like original Maya or Autodesk. That is a fate, a tangible manifestation of Mars's delusion. The phase you crave the most is to be fed on human potential. If a phase depletes your evil meter to zero, you disappear. Oh, so you have to, having evil inside you is good? I'll crush them to bits before they get close. Mason, you use the mind core created by your heart. Press the circle button to push your mind core. If you can volley the pulse back, you will not be hurt by the attack. To retract the mind core, press the X button. Okay. I'm gonna like save state here. talking about like a rhythm game rhythm game I guess it's more like a just, it's more like missile command see people bend at the waist before they jump again. That's my kind of shit. Waiting for you from the inside the mirror. You need rest, touch the mirror. Uh, I think I'm fine. You truly could. Yo, yo, fine. Uh, my old friend, the save dog. I should see what that gold is. Tau gold. Oh, resource. Okay. Killing item. For entry, for details and assistance, speak to an administrator. He said, John, how am I supposed to register? Speak to an admin to get in. that pushes you out, yeah. This game is like a ZZT game. Like the way it's written, it's, this 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 makes sense to none of none of you, but Storage now. I'd have to turn back into like a or into pure enough.
Excellent. All right. It's hitting dog boy. Fuck it, rotates your dog boy. Maybe I can get in his piss, his, his uh, pier not here. Let's see. Prison 4. Registered, registered name, Pirana. Okay. Well, who's that in the distance? Well, the person, like, walking by. What was that? Boomer, I don't think I've seen your face before. Have you been to the oxygen dispensary? The owner, Harad, is the leader of the colony. Or do you <laughs> want to see Psycho Lab? The guys there shoot radio waves into their heads, trying to ride the radio waves. Here to the night. Brought to the oxygen dispensary. The store leads to the Psycho Lab. Oh, I'm, I'm most definitely, I'm sure. Oxygen bars have been a thing forever, though. That's like a 90s fad. Oh, good. I don't think this is real. I think this is another delusion. JJ? Yeah, it's pretty good, although it's uh, definitely a fan translation at times. A lot of uh, excessive swearing. Pro acquired. Pro. Traveler? Like retro 70s furniture. What are you doing here for? Okay. You here for? This room has our space amp we use to gather energy. Ah, key, 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 key. Key, key. There we go, three. That energy is power that comes from Venus. We're gonna fire it into our brains. Can you use it any other way? We look like wireless TVs. It's back. We'll start our big experience. Experiment to utilize Venusian power. It's not quite enough, right? They're they're a little weird, but I I still kind of like them. The faces are off, but it's kind of its very unique style. At least it's kind of its own thing. Gotta give it credit for that, I, I guess. They should remake this but with Zootopia graphics. I don't think I want to talk to that. I think that's the evil mind. That's the evil force of the planet, uh, Mars. I guess we'll see if it's something I need. The bad guy's graphics. They remake it with the Spider-Verse graphics. Hey, comrade. We met before, you and me. Feel sick. Totally about the puke. This sucks. So you're looking for the oxygen dispensary. You need to speak to an employee. I saw a little out by night planet. What the heck was he doing anyways? He threw up on me. I'll check out night planet. It's up. It's just up the road. I'm warning you, that place is highway robbery. You're from Earth, aren't you, comrade? I tell you what, her odd. Don't mind me, I'm just... Much this time around. Guess your dog is back. I 
It's good. Yeah, I don't really know if you can die very easily. It's just like one of those adventure games that's tough to die in. Maybe it gets like crazy later. I'm going to bed now, Uncle. I'm sleepy. But I'm in the mood, Cosmos. Uncle's in the mood. Ugh. Dog boy on liquid television. I don't actually remember that. That sounds so familiar, actually. Hey, Xavier. Ah, it's a poodle. Hi, were you looking for me? By the long face, then, you know, you should do something about that. If you want to fix you, you can get to cosmetic surgery in House Liang. Forget you, you can blow your money at Night Planet. I like Night Planet. It's going pretty good. Playing through Planet Laika. Enjoying it. Gonna get some cosmetic surgery on Mars. Marrakech. You're gonna get your face done too? Things away, unfortunately. You know Feng, right? She's the cosmetic surgeon of House Liang. I came for a face wash. I like to get my face dolled up right before bed. Human faces are still looked down upon on Earth, right? I remember being taught about that trade for our faces. The canine faces we got were symbols of peace for mankind. Peace from what, huh? The Martians died and took our faces with them. At least they left us that mountain, the face. Talk about a sick memento. Ben uses the sculpture as a base model for her work. Face was her inspiration to ever become a cosmetic surgeon. The more my face looks human, the more I feel human. What bliss. They, people get human faces grafted on. Uh, because everybody has a dog face now, because they traded it to the Martians. To not die to the Martians. But now there's a, there's a market of people who get cosmetic surgery to look like humans instead of dogs. Seems stupid. They're supposed to go further into the dog. I get it, I... It's little. It looks like Snively. Wow. It again, huh? What did I do this time? I don't even remember. Who are you? Somebody from Earth? I'm little, got it. I, I work at the oxygen dispensary. But why do you care, huh? Stop holding me up. I don't like him. You're a smart person. You gotta be smarter than me. Grow up with your nose and the books. All you smart people do. It's your job to get out here and solve the big puzzles for us. Yeah, you gotta go back to the mirror. Oh, you know what? I bet I can't get I can't get into the um. Just realized I can't get into the colony if I go back to the mirror because I'll be a different person. I have to find a mirror here, I think. Probably one nearby this this area. Seems how the game is constructed. Oh, night planet. I'm not taking orders right now, even for tourists. Took some of his evil.
It looks pretty cool. I like to I like the bartender's design gold. Same same spot? Right. I guess it's just up. All right. Charlie's awake. Charlie's awake. the mirror now let's see so I didn't go this way you know what to do as long as you obey the rules you'll be fine uh, just like home. Just because I'm a dog doesn't mean I have to talk like one. Prison 4 and its name is a prison on the fourth planet. Now it's a trash heap. You can judge vengeance for saying planet Mars is more of their home than planet Earth. Even if there's little more than a bar and a plastic surgeon. Save point just talks to me instead of letting me save. See what I can do. Yeah, it would be perfect. Oh yeah, I have to get verified. Okay. Be getting Twitter verified. Very cute. He tucked his face in again. Robin update. Always happening. Spacer? Give me a neutron. Like this thing, something fishy about it. This is it. what I have in mind. The problem is the size of the rat. They are big and strong. What if I made them smaller? Like a quarter of their size. And Maku, thank you for the 14 months, or 13 months, excuse me. Uh, welcome to Planet Laika. This is a really strange uh, Japanese adventure game that recently got a translation. Uh, I'm a dog. I'm a dog person who's got three dog persons inside him. Hmm, looks like I'm not getting in. I like spacer. It's a little freak. <laughs> I bet I can, maybe I can make it open doors. I actually don't know what Spacer does. Like, what's his power?
watching Robin right now. You know, he does he does look like a coachy? It's very important. It's just tough. You have to find a. If, if Steve's anything like Robin, I uh, she doesn't sleep in like the same spot. Go pet him now, though. He's gonna want to be in my lap. He's already looking like he wants to be in my lap. He's making like puppy dog eyes. What? Just watching his tail flick. now is a spacer. There's an eye over this. Sounds so feeble like a whisper, but rain, flower, eternity, what does it all mean? All the way back. Maybe he can do something in the uh, safe house or this even. Doors closed now. If I walk all the way back to the rocket and there's like nothing, I would be very shocked, but I feel like it wants me to do or go this far back. Maybe maybe I can use this. Happen. Probably have to use that as as a Piranov and not as one of the other characters. Oh. Big bug. Easy. Music got so dire. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I'm doing mind combat. I did mind combat against one of the one of the monster, one of the the darkness, the darkness, evil, evil mind of of Mars or whatever the fuck is going on. There's a face in Mars, and I think it's it's afflicting me with the evil mind. He has another one. These are fucking rules. It's roughly similar. I, I, I hadn't actually watched Dune or read Dune. 
I'm, I'm a fake Dune fan. They must want me to go back to this rocket then. I haven't watched Dune World yet, no. Did you? <laughs> Have you watched it yet? I have, no, I have nothing against you, and I just never got into it. Oh, that's fair. Oh, I made it back here after doing mine combat. Yeah, place Command and Conquer. Command and Conquer is basically Dune. It's fair. Well, now you have a now you have something to get a DVD player for. I got something to look forward to. Beyond I'm oblivious. Oh, I can get this. I see. No, oh, no, I can't. It's a great walk cycle. I have Blair Witch. Russian Blair Witch sounds great. Or do you mean, oh, Borat in Russian and then also Blair Witch? I'm trying to accomplish fighting all these things, but I guess I'm doing it well. I don't know if I'm if this is what I'm supposed to do. Yeah, he can, but I can't turn into him, like, randomly. Like, I have to talk to people. Like, it's basically, like, a... The, uh... The different, like, the different personalities, uh, I think they're just, like, scripted when you can turn into them when you can't. <laughs> so, Gabby. <laughs> be, be shitty. I'm trapped as a little blue freak. Yeah, I think I can... As Spacer, I think I can switch off of him if I go back to the mirror, but... I don't think it would hard lock me out of anything. Yeah, he's doing the he's doing the he's doing the cool guy has to take a fucking shit walk. <laughs> Alright, let's see some let's 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 engage in some more mind combat. If you just like do this, it pisses him off. There we go, I think I got him. No? Like, I don't. Yeah, okay, so Fungus, I've seen weed that, that there's like a cheese weed, and I've. You know what? I It does taste like cheese. That is not a, t a taste you want your weed to taste like. Yeah, it's really, it's uh, it's really strange. You've you've actually just walked in on some of the more the, the more savor parts too. So, the to recap: you want the cheese weed? I uh, I don't know if you want the cheese weed. Get the cheese weed. We get you the cheese weed, but I don't know if you want it. <laughs> um, yeah, I know. So, if you weren't here earlier, uh, our, our name is uh, we're a we're a communications officer named Leica. Uh, uh, we got sent to Mars to figure out why people are going crazy landing there on uh, something called the Evil Mind. <laughs> it's just a, a purple force that makes you feel bad. This is very, uh, very interesting. About that, I get to take on other 
I get to take on other people's evils by talking to them? <laughs> hey, Jeff Boy RD. Can't, I can't imagine a situation where you'd use that. Okay, so, oh yeah, there was this guy thing, right? The whisper, but grain, flower, eternity. What does it all mean? Rain, flower, eternity. Turn back. Maybe yeah, I did everything I was supposed to do as this character? I don't know. I didn't really do anything. I just like fought a bunch of brain parasites or whatever. Shift back. Great. Every time, I love it. Me watching my food cook in the microwave. Real low. Alright, I think I'll save just in case. Through the colony some more. I still haven't met with the Harad, the oxygen like bar guy. Maybe I just had to cleanse my mind. Fair enough. Yep. He goes through so many shapes in an hour, doesn't he? Oh, he's shifting again. Eternity. Seems like it's the puzzle. Okay, I need to find a grain and I need to. You know? <laughs> I don't want to say anything, but yeah. Charlie's awake. Charlie's awake and you bit my finger. Charlie bit my fucking finger. Get more of that? I need to get it from someone else. I got red. What was that? Well, you see, by talking to people, you take on... Uh, red, blue, or green. And those turn you into specific. Oh, that's a, uh, dog. They're, they're a Martian. You see, we traded, the humans traded their faces to the Martians, uh, for peace. Um, so that's why everyone's a dog person now. Like, all the humans are dog people. Oh, I didn't go this way before. That's, this would probably be why. Um, the Martians immediately went extinct after they got their human faces. And so there's a, there's people who get human faces uh, grafted on instead of their dog faces so they can be human again.
I like, I think, you know, it's a pretty good reason. And that the fact that it's related to the face on Mars makes it even funnier. multiple times. Might have to find out which person I need to be first. It's probably what this puzzle is. Yeah. I don't know if this is right or not, but... I feel like they put these ones here so you can always have a source. Yeah, definitely. So you always have a source of each of the uh, the different mind colors. Let's see what turning yellow gets me. Green? The yellow bar is the fullest. Oh, well, it should probably be red, I think. Oh, you know what? They I have to probably go get all those treasures. Yeah, I don't I don't know if that's intentional. I think it's because I I, I turned into the wrong form. Is this why? Yeah, I think I have to be red, and I gotta go. I gotta I gotta turn into what's his name, Ernest, and then like uh, go punch all those rocks. I wasn't able to go back to the glowy rocks before, but now I can. This is probably the one. God. Weird noises. Maybe not. I think they for well, I mean, I think it's just because I was talking to people. You can, and it just kind of naturally ended up there, but yeah, I think you're right. I think you have to find the right mixture of people to talk to to like get what you need, basically. But you know what? I think, um, is this one? This one is blue. You'd talk to the cosmetic surgeon. Parts weed sandwich. Oh my god, we watched a, a, a episode of a Simpsons yesterday that was from like January, I think. Uh, and it was a uh, the family is like the Simpsons become like an influ a YouTube in influencer family, so all the jokes are about them having like sponsorships and stuff and making content and being content farm farming people and stuff it's so embarrassing and everybody in springfield is a youtuber now oh, i don't want to talk to this guy no everyone in springfield's a youtuber and they're all trying to make uh content uh and they're, they're also all following um the simpsons as like uh like we gotta follow the- this is the latest update on the Simpsons family on YouTube. The worst part is it's like mostly just kind of like the same as the behind the music episode they did like a long time ago. Like it's it's a lot of jokes about like, oh the family are all just actors who don't like each other. Right? And they're actually a family, etc, etc. But like, at the end of the, the YouTuber one, it like... They, they, it, the, the spoiler for this, they, they accidentally locked themselves in a panic room and that's why no one can find them. But... I don't know what that is. Uh, but, so... But then they, 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 they start to learn to love each other as a family at that, at that point. And it's just like, literally nothing in the episode led to this like, weird, shrekly, like, payoff. Like, there was no emotional investment like in the episode. It was like a goofy, like cutaway a bunch of different cutaway gags episode charlie's awake he bit my damn finger charlie bit my finger sorry i'm trying to find more red brain gas
keep talking to people. Oh, I haven't been in I haven't been in the oxygen dispensary. Shit, found it. Or I have to go here. I feel so bad for uh, Julie Kavner's voice. Came from Earth. Came for her odd. Yeah, I like them. In West Hell. I can tell why they came. Oh, good. It's, it's this type of character. It's like uh, the, the guys from Final Fantasy IX. Come back with the red stone. Come back with the red stone. The one they say shines brightly. The one inside the UFO building on Brick Road. Yeah. The door won't open. If you're smart, it will open. Can the door be opened? Yes. Smart. Where does one get smart? In the mirror room. The mirror room? The room with the vast mirror. The mirror I hate and do not wish to see. Those mirrors are taboo. It will lead to the redstone in her room. Uh, UFO building on Brick Road will. I guess so. Comrade, did those nuts want something from you? Wait, I'm right, ain't I? I can see it on your face. So what do they want? Something slippery, I bet. Yeah, they want the red stone. That's what they want you to find for them? Too bad, no one's actually laid eyes on the red stone. The door to the UFO building, it's inside of won't open. Even Boomer can't break it down. It just freaks everybody out. Death has many doors. So guys like Young and Crow say, but some of us aren't blue enough to play that game. Well, but about that, you know those booby si the booby-sized eyeballs some people see on the door? You'll have to talk to that giant booby to get inside. This is so funny, this is stuff I already did. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, but I've already, like, seen everything, so I'm not sure what the right solution is. Maybe I go to the mirror now and see what it gives me. Apparently. Oh, yeah, here it is. So the red... red brain gases. I, you know, I think I have to find three sources of whatever color I'm trying to turn into. Whatever, whatever. If I'm trying to be red, blue, or green here. Like... We're back. In the mirror avenue, it's ginormous. Who knows what it's really for? Are you sure you want to see yourself in it? Think that the spirits live inside mirrors? Thought so. See it or not, you just sense these things, but I don't want Bloody Mary's ghost popping out to grab me. You know, the one where the mirror turns orange and a woman laughs. If you're a visual type, don't go near mirrors at night. Okay. But yeah, I'm not there yet. <laughs> I know, right? Well, I mean, you know, they want to tell the story. It's fine. Definitely save. <laughs> That's true, though. Maybe there's someone in the psycho uh, lab that I can... I think there might be. 
But I might need to be. I want to get all the. I want to break all the treasure out of the blocks first. So if I need to turn blue, I'll turn blue. But all right. I love these rooms that don't make sense though. That are you like suffering like an intense like hallucination like that? Very cool. Oh. Exactly. Hmm. I think so. I can't remember where the ruined theater was. I think so too. I don't know, I feel like it's, so there's been multiple sources of it though. Like, well, like you can get it from like people, or like, and then there's like a spot on the ground you can get it from, but it's like. Yeah, it seemed like it. That's so they updated pizza. Oh, yeah, there we go. So you're so right. They updated pizza tower so that like there's a new dead zone for controllers and like It feels way more responsive, but at the same time I got used to like the janky movement that I was using on, on the controller before so now it's just like oh god I have to like actually be like better Hey, Pilk I'm the planet Laika to turn into Ernest and punch some gold out of some rocks. Maybe engage in some mind warfare real quick. I feel like I probably have to go back this way and get all these anyway, but I guess we'll see. Uh, it's like uh, Lost Vikings. That's one evil. What does that mean? <laughs> yeah, the art style really grows on you. Why there's nothing here to fight my brain. Restores Ernest's Ernest health. Why not? Yeah, no, he looks great. Big dumb guy. Robot arms. Yeah, nothing here for me. some more we gotta do some more face combat Whom. 
That's for real though. system again i don't know why a game calls a place called this an rpg it's like not an rpg at all it's very funny capsule acquired okay got a lot of like healing items and such yeah the sound is like the sound design is like top notch for sure we can go back to the rocket i guess maybe Power's been boosted. And my treasure. White stone and cryo. I'm definitely gonna need that, I think. Can I go inside the spaceship? It's probably nothing for me here. And oh, oh. Um. I love how serious this music is. It's very, very weird combat. Like, it's just two buttons. Like, one moves that thing forward, like that bobbing blue thing, and use it to reflect attacks back. And then one button just brings it all the way back to the start instantly. So, like, just, like, Pong, I guess? Brain Pong? Mini game, yeah. Only we could be so lucky. Faces, yeah. But it's almost entirely faces. Okay, well, I definitely probably had to get that white stone, so this was not a waste of time. So that was a key object, at least. I'm assuming I have to become a uh, spacer, the blue guy, to uh, look at the door again for the story. If you hit the orange, the orange crystal, it reflects everything back. Back. They just sent me a picture of a rat, I had to reply. Always. I'm gonna probably revert back here to Piranov and then maybe take a little break. I, it's it's 9.30, but I could probably go for some more. I'd like to at least get past this puzzle. 
But I should take a break, it's been like two hours. Waiting for you from inside the mirror. Come a different dog boy. Amazing. Cutscene never never fails to <laughs> never fails to uh, impress. It's like the it's like the deception cutscene. Um, I'm gonna take a break though. This is this is the perfect time to take a break. Save state. Pause. Of the BRB screen. Why not? Robin's no longer on the BRB screen, unfortunately. Um, excuse me. I'm going to run an ad, as usual. Um, don't watch the ad. Mute the tab. Walk away. Do something else for like three or four minutes. But I'm going to go to the bathroom and get water, you know. Nothing nothing too out of the ordinary. I'm going to put on some uh, some music, I think. Very loud, didn't it? I'm back. Hello. Welcome back, everybody. Thank you for your patience. I'm sitting through. Oh, so bad. This down. All right. We can we can switch back. So let's get back to the dog game. Um. I guess I should, but Robin didn't move. Not really. Just looks slightly. He just looks slightly pissed off. I didn't pet him. Walk by, but if I pet him. He'll want more attention, and then he'll get up from his spot, and then I'll lose out on monetization, and people won't want to watch the stream anymore if he's not here. So you know, he's taking one for the team. <laughs> yeah, Robin brings in the big dollars. I, I would I would have a thing on the throne that would be like buy him treats, but he doesn't like treats. He's not He wants corn chip. I guess I get I guess we could put like a Robin special on the on treat stream. You wanna send him a whole bunch of uh Taco Bell corn chips. Is the capture mess Oh it is! What the heck? Weird. just happened strange I don't know what that was that was really weird yeah he'll still eat all those chips probably but that was like the proper size I don't understand that's like exactly the right size I want it to be like nope It was, it was steadfastly refusing to look like this before. You know, I need to be blue now. For an eyeball? I can't see the eyeballs no matter what I do. Is that a hoax? Huge text on the screen. There wasn't anything you missed. I just, I turned back from um, Ernest into his character. To find the, the infinite source of a uh, blue mind power. Here it is. I'm 
this one to him go. Oh no. Oh no, it's the end of the age. Oh, he wants attention. He's coming for me. He's looking at me. He said he's gone. Let's see if he returns. In the stream, cut it. It's been two hours. I'm giving him pets. Giving him his pay for the day. He's a, he's a, he is a worker. He does deserve to get paid to have his pets. Start the contract. You know. Oh, there we go. Now I'm blue. Hi. Yeah, but I got my blanket on, bud. You don't want to be up here with the blanket. You get all weird. Come on. I gotta put Cat Cam away. He, he's gonna be sitting in my lap, I think. Yeah, here he comes. Sorry, he wants to be in my lap. It's part of the territory. He's fine, he's in my lap, he didn't leave. Alright. Yeah, he wants to watch Planet Like It. He was watching me play Pizza Tower earlier, that was very funny. Like, uh, I want to say it was either this morning or last night, he was just like, he had his paws up on the, the desk. But I think it's partly because I got a bag of catnip behind the keyboard that he can't really see. He can probably smell and it drives him nuts. little freak. Doing that thing when cats cats get too many pets and they just like stand up at like max length of their legs rather than get comfortable. He's doing that, but he's like stumbling like he's drunk. It's very cute. Too many pets. Alright, we're spacer again. Let's see if I can open that door. Let's see if it actually like progresses the story. Yeah, fucking A. Yeah. It's true though. From it fucks with your posture from carrying your big brain around. I can hear words in my head. Be a world in a grain of sand, and heaven in a wildflower. Hold infinity in the palm of your hand. Eternity in an hour. It's from an old poem. Interesting. It's very cute. Robin. Robin did not like jumping into my lap until recently. He used to do it a long time ago, but he just kind of stopped. Uh, for a couple of years, but ever since I started streaming in the new place, he like wants to jump in my lap constantly. True though, if he if he comes to, if he if he makes it as easy as possible for me to pet him, such as sitting in my lap, I will always pet him. Great. Like fucking excellent. Oh, and he's drooling all over me. Gross. Nasty little drool man. Don't slip. Do some mind combat. He drools when he gets pet a bunch. He gets really happy from from pets. Something on the ground, yeah? Oh. 
He's shedding so much. The stone is an oxygenite? No, I've seen it somewhere before. I'll probably just use. I need to make space. I'm assuming for another item. Easy. Yeah, the puzzle finally solved. Just keep moving. The pollution. All over my arm. Yeah. Waiting for you from the inside. Can't get into the prison colony as one of the uh, other three. going on I guess April's here that's that's she's that's our crewmate April oh there's more people here One piece. Yeah, talking eyeballs, real. Yeah. So they're real. Too bad I can't see it. Check out the psycho lab. The guy there is experiencing radio waves. Came with the redstone. That face says yes. Give it. Hand it over. I wouldn't worry about it too much. This is the redstone. We have to figure out what the fuck is going on on Mars. Dogface did well. That's right, and yes, you're a dog. We hate dogs. Who doesn't? Should be thrown into space. You agree? Should be a foo. Oh god. Yeah, they're very Zorn and Thorn. What's all the fuss about? What's about the survey unit? Survey unit on Mars. You here for the terraforming project? Let me guess. You're here to see if we're up, up to any trouble. I mean, I don't know what you expected to find out here. Tell them everything. It's peachy. It's peachy means no trouble. No trouble's here. What do you earth bogeys want to do here anyhow? Maybe this should stay, uh, stay between you and me, but... I work too hard to have to put up with the ISS shit, got it? I rebuilt this planet from the dust up after you pars after you parasites dumped it. I found the oxygenite veins and opened the mines. I made this place livable. I arrived this colony to be like Earth, not belong to Earth. That was the winter of our discontent. Make glorious summer by me. Hurrah. Great. Winter's over? They love their fancy vignettes. So no hard feelings, but no debates. I won't roll out the red carpet for you. Arrange a night stay for you. You're gonna leave tomorrow morning. For this one to cell 13, I'm turning into. Robin is still here. God, he's getting fur like all over me though. He is shedding so bad. Ugh. Like 
all over my face. Prison is now a hotel. I don't know, he just loves his shed. He's a hairy baby. Her hotel, cell 13, across from his house, Liang. Mark's popular plastic surgery office. Will you get fixed at House Liang dog face? We, we hate dogs. Sleep now. Alright. like it's in here but I'm pretty sure it's outside yeah oh, bye Robin F do you want a lullaby we sing a lullaby oh, Robin wants out one sec let me let me let the boy out yeah, he's Come through that he did. Was that was that hearable at all? It was very cute. Mirror in here. It's lights out time. Lights are turning off. Back in the toy palace. What are you doing home from school so early? Um, weird little fu- I don't have time for you. Go find Sergei and play with him. Found a dog face. Oh, how exciting. I came because a rod called for you, too. We're just there. The rod wants to sleep now, so you too much fuss Ag Agatha for him. Does Herod need Agatha? He can't sleep without Agatha. We not stop his nightmares? We can't, but Agatha will help. We get to leave now. your friends did you come here with them a couple of knuckle bones you're not a total space case like they are i hope you at least know what knuckle bones are right that's the name of an old dice game that used animal bone pick turns until someone rolled a venus and won the pot that's how i live saving up my lucky rolls for the right moment while dealing with those two the right moment so consider yourself the lucky winner of the night i'm veronica and you are i get to choose Go by a nickname or I think so too. Like I saw another new face over at Night Planet, a young woman. Gold never leaves Night Planet, so you can ask him about her. That creeper Smokey is always a regular in the same bar. I hate Smokey, I'd rather he die. You meet him, you'll agree. Oh. 
didn't know you came here with such a pretty woman. She was looking for you. one now. Hey there, Scout. How goes your little patrol? Where do you think you're going? No good snobby cub, Scout. Amscray. But Amscray twice. So you want to buy a drink, of course. I don't want to be anywhere near this snob. I start something, you snob. If you had business with Old Smokey here, you should have said so sooner. What's the matter? Don't you drink? You do now. I'll treat you to the real good stuff. You should say something. Are you here to drink or not? What do you want, huh? Who raised you? Shove so many drinks down your throat, you'll puke, manner. <laughs> Come on, Smokey. That's enough for now. No one tells me how much is enough. <laughs> So what the fuck? Looks like a Thomas the Tank Engine. Wrong. You scared? You wanna cry for mommy? Then cry, <laughs> cry, bitch. Or I'll bash your head so bad you'll drown in your own blood. this time. We didn't come to Mars and start a fire. Your trouble he does about the environment. Came to inspect. You heard about uh, Colonel Galil from the original ISF Vanguard unit? The guy's a legend after all the I am the light. I'm foolery. It sounds like any other weirdo to me. He's really what you're here for? She's here to drink. Here at Snob Planet, we keep it up all night long. We're also looking for two of our unit members. So there's more of you? <laughs> How'd y'all get here, clown car? I like Smokey. I don't know what they're talking about. My favorite character. Stick around and blow the roof off of old Smokey. <laughs> get off, creeps. I don't know how a piggy's supposed to squeal, Missy. This riding is wild. That time we called it a night. Yes. That smug look on her face says she's fine. It's you two eyesores. It's just two of our teammates are missing. They're not here. Again, anyone with a brain wouldn't waltz in here. Not with those uniforms. Bad shit happens to hunky dory snobs like you. They're not snobs. Listen, men. From Earth, just like you. They must be the survivors from the Vanguard unit. They are so wide. It's used for that brain dead bunch. Lodge behind the large ventilation tower in Midtown. Talk to the medicine men. Turs. Cosmos. Those lights out time. You know the medicine men? The medicine man is someone who sings and dances to help the sick. What makes the medicine men so different? Do they not get along with the rest of the colony? Extraordinary powers. Mountain stirs up trouble by insisting that they're frauds. And who is Mountain? 
researcher at Psycho Lab. He knows the pen under the Medicine Men's Lodge. But nothing stalks the Medicine Men and spies on their activities. This is getting, like, so wild. There's so many new characters they're adding. Why would he spy on them? Because they don't like him either. The Medicine Men don't believe in Venusians like Mountain does. People from Venus know. The Venusians are the energy waves sent from planet Venus into space. Up into your face. Cosmos, where are you? Got a human face. Purple red. I have to go now, but good luck on your trip. I just got like a horrid craving for like some sort of like fish with pin bones in it, like a white fish. I think that would be just kind of a pain in the ass to eat, but it'd be so good. Then you have to pick like the fish meat around, like horrible little bones that'll choke you. Every day, morning, night, I'm always so sleepy. my cursor keep showing up that's so weird it's like not even on that monitor Psycho. Definitely have to go to the Psycho Lab, I think. Oh, there he is, Mountain. You're a messenger here to bring good news and great joy. Where you say you're from, Venus or Earth? We you think otherwise, but life's phenomena are never so simple. It's chaos brews, the planet, and their names are always in stir. You're up to the medicine men. They do have their PhDs in screwing around, don't they? They should underestimate. They shouldn't underestimate the Venusians, and yet they do. If you want into the lodge, I'll give you the auto locks pin. It is six, just six. I figure out where to put that in. I have a message from Commander October. Greetings, Lyka. Is that you? I think Earth, Earth finally got a taste of Mars's uproar. The face lit up. It assaulted us suddenly with an array of radio waves and light beams. I took it for a prank, but now we're hearing news reports of miracles on Earth. That came back to life. I can recite all of Pi. I fear this is no miracle. I'll contact you again when they update. Right. I remember where I'm supposed to take the pen. Outside the ventilation tower. Oh, yeah. Got all to the lodge. Do you remember the pin? Do. 
They use a single digit number for their pin. Who's out there? The International Space Force, we come for Earth. Here to speak with the Mietis the Mietison men. We had to make an emergency landing. Lost touch with the rest of our crew. I'm like too far away, sorry. No one enters the lodge. Feeling, feeling a lot like Harvester here. Where are they about to tell us about you? Instead, if we met you, you'd possibly have an idea where our crew went. Adam, don't listen to a thing he says. We're the only people here we can count on. Sure. Back at the bar gave me the worst vibes. Three types of evil on Mars with those two groups in the bar and that nerd mountain <laughs> got me thinking. Not the same types of evil at all, are they? Mountain is psychotype. That Venusian obsessed mongrel is a psychotype. Nerd mountain. Mountain who sent you here? Are you a medicine man? Wish to meet our elder the lodges this way. Inside the lodge, I'll wait here. It's gonna be like a save point here, right? from Earth. That's right. The rest of our crew is missing. Mayhaps they are bewitched by the ill will of the planet. Ill will of the planet? This is very Final Fantasy 7. The planet is rife with ill will. We call it we call its miasma evil mind. It's a fitting name for Mars's malice. Evil mind. It's not as simple as toxic topsoil, I see. Maybe this ill will, will was what got to Colonel Galil. Galil? Give up on ever finding him. The man was the final piece, you understand. Understand what? What's the significance of this final piece? You know the tale of the Black Rider? Revelations? Ah, here we go. Okay. Here's the black clad horseman who brought death and ruin to the world. We gotta we gotta have a Bible reference if it's a PS1 game. Damn. He has since crossed Mars, calling on ghastly evils to join him. He becomes wholly evil. The world will meet its end. The hour of judgment is here. This is the planet's destiny. That's yeah, really good, really good art. City judgment, how pathetic. You know about the prophecies? Not a thing. The ISF was worried about rumors hurting the terraformer. Terraformation Project. The unit's mission is to investigate the rumors and find Colonel Galil. Terraformation, I see. Is this to bring more people up to Mars? Cannot, will not, absolutely must not happen. 
it'll be a good thing. Are you scared of potential disorder? All people carry evil in their I know, it's so it's so melodramatic. This reminds me a lot of uh like Xeno Gears in that way, where it's just like, okay, calm calm down. Calm down, Xeno Gears. We all saw Evangelion. People carry evil in their hearts. It's that extra evil we can't afford. There are good people too. How long has it been since I heard that phrase? No one is wholly good. Good and evil exist in strict balance. I see. What you're saying is you don't trust anyone to be good. No, not on this planet. Look at your companions. Are they good or evil? But I can say that much. Is that enough for you? I'm so sure. Go now and bear witness with your own eyes. The valley is memoriae. Baye's Memoriae. Little brick wall is a black wall that extends open to the valley. A black wall and brick road? Thank you very much. Oh, Rose, thou art sick. That's the password. It's a great game. Believe it for uh, Valle's Memoriae. Valle's Memoriae. <laughs> but where the lost memories that try to resurface as you walk the land? Some of those memories can and will be false. Thank you for warning us. Actually, may I ask you one thing? Vanity Face is so popular on Mars. Why haven't you guys gotten plastic surgery? Like you, we did not come to Mars for human faces. That is an evil path. I saw a young boy with a lovely face. The technology has come so far. Full roses stem from wild, vile roots watered by evil mind. You saying it's evil to want to be beautiful? Evil specifically is greed. That is what we call a visual type evil. Mountains evil is wisdom, and those eyes, those types, oh. They're the ones who preoccupy their time with wily imaginations. Greed and wisdom. If psychotype is wisdom, what is animal type? Heavens be, how do you know so much? The answer is power. Like those who puff their chests in taverns. That's all three, huh? Thank you so much. No matter how strange your visions are in Valet's Memoria, I do not succumb to them. Alright, Cosmos, let's get the medicine on your face now. Getting made this darling face for you. That's right, me. Uh. We're seeing cosmetic surgery on him. Ah, he's a. Uh... Game got weird. <laughs> I guess it's about time to it's time to call it anyway. Uh, yeah, now now it's getting weird. Yeah, it's been like over an hour since my last save, um, or almost an hour, whatever. Um, yeah, this is, this is a good time to stop though. I'll probably pick this up again. I don't know if I'll pick this up again this weekend or not. This is a lot of reading. This is more reading than I want to do when I'm playing and game for stream. Um, let me switch over to the end screen. Let's keep this song going. I like this. This is good. Find someone to raid. Yeah, thanks Thanks for coming out. As usual, you know, folks. Let me see who we got. Who we got up? I'll be back probably Sunday. I'm thinking Sunday. I'm thinking Saturday I want to just, like, play. 
Oh, Dot's still going. Yeah. Oh, random person on front of Twitch. Yeah, let's get right Dot. That's a no-brainer. Uh, she's playing uh, Sub-Zero Mythologies. You know, that classic. But, yeah, I'll be back Sunday, probably like 11 or noon. I gotta figure. I, I want to figure out something fun to play, so start but have a nice day everybody see you again